So one thing you may or may not know about Cory is that he loves peanut M&Ms. By far his favorite candy. So today I'm going to play a little prank on him. At least I'm going to try. <laughs> What's up, guys? It is a beautiful day. Uh, today's date night for us. We've been uh, we've been busy doing yeah. a lot of stuff. You know, doing yeah. uh, I've been doing my animation stuff, which is going awesome. And I'm kind of bummed out because the uh, the new Mean Kitty song accidentally got leaked. But nobody knows that. No. 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 Yeah. No. No. Nobody no. Knows nobody knows that. that. Except for the people who might leave a comment and tell everybody what they how thought of the song. How good it was exactly because right? that's it's a good song. <laughs> so yeah we're gonna go uh we're gonna go out we're gonna do some date type stuff. We're, we're gonna, gonna go, go see a movie for date night and then we're gonna buy a lawnmower because Oh that's so romantic. That's what married people do. Nothing says love like a lawnmower. <laughs> Yesterday was our one month anniversary so it's kind of like an anniversary present. <laughs> it is it is yesterday was our one month happy one month anniversary <laughs> Late. You're one late. month and one day. Come on. <laughs> yeah. Hey, every day, every day matters. It's it's that True. special. This is, you know, we're celebrating <laughs> our our love and our our union, our marriage. Yeah. All right. So Corey's out at the store getting me some cough drops because my throat's really been sore. I don't know if it's the allergies or all the traveling I've been doing. Either way, I'm not feeling too good. So while he's gone, I'm gonna try and play a little prank on him. It's a nice one. It should be fun. All right, so what I'm going to do is take three bags of these peanut cocoa balls from Korea, and I'm going to put them in the ice dispenser of our freezer. So then when Corey goes to get me some ice, it's going to rain out peanut M&Ms. All right, so we're going to open the freezer, pull out the ice maker. I already emptied it, so there's no ice in there. Grab a bag of peanut cocoa balls and just dump them. I think I could use two more bags. All right, the freezer's beeping at me, so I'm gonna close it up. Should I test it? I kind of want to test it. I'm gonna test it. This is gonna be awesome. I'm practicing. For what? I don't know, my vlogging. Yeah? What'd you bring me? I brought you cough drops. I brought you mail. Oh, mail. And I brought me a whole ton of energy drinks. <laughs> because they're cheap and because I need to drink them. To stay awake. No, not to stay awake, to stay focused. Oh. Yes. Here's your cough drops. Extra strength with natural menthol cough suppressant. <laughs> Even though you're not coughing. When I, when I was like having my nastiness. It hurts. That's what I would have wanted. Thank you. I love you. I love you're you. You're sweet. Oh. A buck piece. A buck a piece. A buck a piece. Hey, can you get me an ice cube for my hot tea? Just use your hand, it's okay. Let me wash it. Loving. You're trying to get better. I'm trying, watching. I don't know which one is which. You have to hold it down. Do I? Yeah. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Clever. <laughs> it's full of M&M's. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. You. You. I'm so proud of myself right I'm now. I'm glad. I didn't hit the crushed ice. That would have been terrible. I 
know I was nervous about that. I was two seconds from doing the crushed ice, dude. It was worth the risk. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> Cocoa peanuts ball. Yeah, yeah. They're all over the floor, huh? Mm, I think I got them all. As long as Penny doesn't eat them. Yeah. Dogs don't eat chocolate. No. There's one there. Yeah, I got all of them. Okay, good. So, uh, yeah, this week is going to be a lot of fun. Uh, probably tomorrow something big is going to happen. So excited for it. Um, I've uh, kind of mentioned it on Twitter and Facebook, but Dude Like Hella is going through some changes. Yeah. Um, a little yeah. bit of a change. Uh, In a good way. All good. All good In changes. Good way. Uh, one way is going to be the uh, technology that we use to, to vlog. Uh, some of you have kind of mentioned it, but I'm not gonna, you know, spoil it and say what it is. You guys are gonna, just gonna have to see what it is. Also, the uh, the amount that we're vlogging yeah. is gonna change. Yeah, I'm nervous about the first thing. Not the second thing, I'm good with that. The first, the technology thing, I'm a little nervous about. Yeah, uh, it's, I, I really want to give it away, but I don't. I just, just know that it'll be good. Awesome. But I'm also nervous. I don't, is the, the great thing about the technology is it doesn't have to apply to everybody. Right. You can choose to or to not. But for me as a filmmaker, it is flipping exciting. I mean, it is, for the 10 years that I've been on YouTube, I have always been one of the people to jump on it. Like as soon as something new comes out, I want to test it, I want to beat it into the ground, and I want to know everything about it, and I want to push the limits of what you can do with that technology. Yeah. And that is exactly what I'm going to do with this. Like I want to take Dude Like Hella to a whole new level in a way that uh, you guys are, it's, it's not, it's not going to be the same in the best way possible. Yeah. It really is. It's going to be amazing. It will be. Yeah. But not every video is going to be using this technology. It's only going to be sometimes. Um, mainly because, damn, it's, 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 it's not going to be like super easy. Like, oh, here we go. It's, no. it's hard and yeah. very expensive. I'm going to tell you that too, guys. It's like, I, I love it. This is why it's worth it to me. I love filmmaking. I love trying new things. But if you guys could do me a huge favor, now is a good time to share the videos and to really help us out with that because, you know, the more that, that people see us, the more we can give to you and, and this sort of stuff is, is exciting. True. Very exciting. True. Exciting. So please share. It really does mean a lot to us. Like, pretty much every dime I've been making on Dude Like Hella lately has been going back into Dude Like Hella. So, yeah, and this one was a lot of dimes. Yeah, so was the Iditarod. Yeah. <laughs> that was. Oh man, that but was. But it's good. I'm glad you spent a lot of dimes on your coat for the Iditarod, or else you would have frozen. Oh my god, you guys, that coat for the Iditarod was, uh, I, w I want to say it was like. It uh, was. That's the most expensive thing. Yeah. I've, uh, the most expensive article of clothing I've ever owned by. Probably four. But well worth it. Well worth well it. Well worth it. Well, well worth it. But anyway, so, yes, lots of talking. Let's get to date night. We're going to watch some dinosaurs. So Jurassic World was freaking awesome. What do you think? It's very good. Dude, seriously, you very guys good. have to see it. It's it's like a seriously worthy follow-up to like the whole Jurassic Park series. In fact, it's I would say it's like it's it's almost to the level of the first one. All I didn't say all the way. Okay. I was getting ready to punch you in the face. No, because the first one was way too epic. I mean, it was also a whole different thing. Well, that's that's the cool thing about this one, too, is this one was its own thing. Definitely. Like, it paid tribute to, you know, the first Jurassic Parks. Park. 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 Well, there's a couple Jurassic Forget Parks. Forget the other ones. Yeah. But, 
but yeah, this was awesome. By the way, it is so weird. This is our first time going to a movie in Alaska, and it is so weird getting out and seeing light. Yeah, but you don't, it's not that great. Oh, thank you. I wear my sunglasses at night so I can, so, so I, I can. can. So you can what? He never finishes that. It's so he can look across the room and not have her know. Like, am I looking at the camera right now or am I looking at you? You don't know. What if he's just sleeping so I can't sleep? What is that in the road? That fell off a truck for sure. That totally did. You know, there's a lot of boxes like sitting on the side of the road that just like sit there. Like sometimes I want to like stop the car and I want to investigate the box and see what is inside the box. Do you ever do you ever do that? No, because I know someone who did that and they found a large amount of illegal substances in a box. And so now I'm too afraid. But if I had these sunglasses on like this, no one would know. Ah, uh, got it. See, I, I did that one time. One time, a long time ago. This is I just actually just reminded me. Uh, I was a kid growing up in Hillmar, California, and there was this one bridge that crosses the Merced River. It's called the Lander Bridge. And uh, I used to go under there all the time, just ride my three-wheeler, because that's what I did when I was a kid. And there was this box underneath the, the Lander Bridge, and I was like, oh, cool. I opened it up, and I'm not kidding you guys. This, like, it was a big box. Nothing but ladies' toys. An entire box. All so all shapes, sizes, colors, and functionalities. That's better than what I thought you were gonna say. I thought you were gonna say uh, like human uh, feces. You know what? At that point, I would much rather have found human feces. You think that box smelled good? No. It, I you know I was at the river. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna go there. No. <laughs> it sure did smell like fish. <laughs> I said it. I said it. I That's went. so mean. So I really love you and I love that you did laundry, but whatever that is on my pants makes me smell like fish. Oh my god. Why do you have row in your pocket? I didn't oh, put it there. Babe, oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I have no idea how that got there. All day, like, everyone's been like, hey, Kristen, yeah, see you later. Like, no one's talked to me. <laughs> no one, like, I'm like, man, fish, it just smells like fish. Oh, my God. What? That, I don't even know if that's row. I, and it's hard and crunchy. Babe, take those pants off. <laughs> that's just, oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> How, I don't, honestly, I do not understand how that happened. Like seriously, I, I really don't. I'm trying to think, I'm trying to think of every situation where I've ever had fish near any clothes. Like, I, I, I don't, I don't. In my pocket. In your pocket. In like there. that's, that's weird. Even if it, even if it was like turned inside out, how did it get in your pocket? In my pocket. In the, I'm checking. I have to check all pockets now. I'm good. I didn't have fish in my pockets. I was weirdly hungry all day, too. Look at that. Wait, what is that? That's thread. Oh, gosh. Oh, it smells so fishy. Oh, my, oh, my God. That's not even, like, a little bit. That's like a pocket full of row. Whoa. Whoa. How? I don't know. Like that's not even row. That's <laughs> that's like that's like a fish gizzard. No. Oh. It's bad. It's so bad. I didn't. I didn't put fish in my pocket. I... <laughs> We're going fishing. Why don't you just wear these out? I mean, it <laughs> might it might attract the fish. No, because then it'll become a superstition, and every time we go fishing, I'll have to put fish in my pocket. That would be the best superstition ever. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm the one with the painted toe. You do. <sighs> it looks so pretty still. Dude, I, uh, I actually went out today to get my energy drink and I was wearing 
my uh, flip flops and I looked down and I was like, oh my God, I got, I got a purple toe. And I was just kind of like hiding and just like walking around the store trying not to get seen. Hey, how's it going? Walking all sideways. <laughs> Why? This, I just, I don't get it. I don't get it. Like, you didn't wear these in South Korea. You didn't take these. No. I, my guess is you took them on the first trip. Did you have sushi? Why would I put sushi in my pocket? They have to-go boxes. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you just really had to go. <laughs> saying goodbye to sunshine, saying goodbye to warm. Heading to Alaska where ice will be the norm. So much to see, so much to do. And the best part is we're sharing it with you. Do like hello.